Hello everyone, this is Adam Mountain Farmer. It is Friday, July the 20th, 2017. Uh, it is about 15, 10:15 p.m. And uh, I am unloading the tractor. I've sprayed everything tonight except for except for the corn I've still got to spray the corn but I won't be spraying the corn tonight I'll spray it first thing in the morning so uh, but just uh, real briefly Kind of give you an idea, like I said, the, the point of this broadcast, if you will, is to give people an idea of what small vegetable farmers go through. Um, I shouldn't say go through. What what we what we do is a, a better way to do it. Put it. Uh, we uh, I started spraying this evening. It was ridiculously hot today, mid to upper 80s. Uh, so I started spraying this evening about six or seven o'clock. Like I said, it's ten o'clock, and I got everything sprayed but the corn. Uh, and I'm just unloading the tractor off the trailer so I can reload the sprayer in the morning, and not have to bring it off a wet trailer. It's uh, it can get a little squirrely coming off that trailer. But uh, like I said, we'll. Uh, just kind of give you a quick update. Uh, I will be cutting cabbage tomorrow. I will uh, be picking corn next week. It's, uh, I don't know whether you can see me or not, but uh, that's the plan. Anyhow, and uh, we'll, we'll take you along for that. Uh, had someone ask me today if our corn was non-GMO after the video I posted yesterday and uh, well there's no such thing as non-GMO sweet corn there is non-GEO which is genetically engineered all corn is modified from what it was originally so therefore it is genetically modified um, that's uh, that's one of my pet peeves is the uh, use of the term GMO or non-GMO. Uh, corn's not sweet. We've uh, modified it through breeding and other techniques for hundreds of years to make it sweet. Uh, people ask about GMO products. Uh, well, everything's modified. Uh, what they really are asking about is genetically engineered products. And that's where uh, resistance to a certain insect disease, etc., is injected into the genes of the plant and uh, the seed. And uh, so, our corn is non-GEO, but it is GMO. So, uh, if you don't believe me, look it up. It, uh, I really don't care. You know what people think. I mean. Everyone's entitled to their opinion and to spend their grocery dollar however they want. It's just uh, that term kind of irritates me. It really does. So, this has been Adam, a mountain farmer. It uh, Like us, subscribe to us, check us out on Facebook, Rocky Hollow Farm. I am going to have some dinner and call it a day. So, until next time, take care of yourself. Bye.